So we're going to go ahead and go live and go through all this with everybody. So first couple of things in regards to the actual site audit. It's got 781 issues. This will take me about a day to fix. Uh, you do have some resources restricted from indexing, 301 redirects, some mechanical rel issues going on here. I need to get that fixed. Um, other than that, it's not much when it comes to, the, if you will, the on-page SEO aspect of what needs to be fixed. All right. This is the actual website. If I was to look at this actual website, you know, when your sticky header rolls, you don't have a button up here that really pops out. You do have this one. Um, you do not have, let's take a look at a bunch of this stuff. You do have your GMB here, which is awesome. It's an embed that's pulling in your reviews. You don't have the actual text reviews inserted. Um, if you don't know what I mean, I could actually explain that to you, but let's see what else we got here view larger map so you just have an actual address here in Ireland this is not an actual GMB listing um, that's problem number one let's see if we go to your contact page if we got the same situation so yeah we don't even have a GMB in your contact us page so you got several things going on here it's going to be an issue when it comes to SEO um, especially GMB SEO um, as far as your content you have a decent amount of content on each page which is great but the overall structure if we look at it for instance if we go to your home page you know I see per, a proficient reliable creative painting service in Dublin I personally wouldn't want all of this you know stuffed in here I would rather put painting service Dublin painting service professional painting services Dublin something of that nature um, but the rest of this I actually like a lot of the structure okay I like the fact that you got tons of content I like the fact that you got multiple um, call to actions like this and you know this one up here and you got them all over the place which is really cool and a lot of people don't do that and they screw up. I can't even, let's see if I can try to get your GMB. Um, so yeah, you don't even have this GMB embedded in your footer. This is some weird, you know, embed that's not even connected to this GMB, right? And then it's definitely not in the contact page either. So this needs to be inserted, right? Then if we look at your reviews, let's see if you're responding to them. This is great anytime you can have your review providers put in some pictures that's outstanding. Your reviews are good. Some of them are very generic. I'd want longer, at least paragraph or review responses, not just thank you, thank you. Um, make sure to always hit your thumbs up on these reviews. Um, go in here and take some action. These are called behavioral signals that you're sending to GMB okay <clears throat> that's one aspect you have your appointment link your website link great um, let's see what how you're stacking yeah you're not stacking your Google my business if you will your GMB posts I could show you exactly how I personally do my posts I do them very specifically um, and I know I've showed everybody this repetitively you know but I'll show you again I teach this in my Google My Business Reloaded class, but let's go through this and I'll show you an actual post. Okay, let's go to the posts. So if you see this post, I actually have the, you go, step one is what is the post about packing services? So I want the logo on here. I want my website or my address and phone number on here. Um, I want the first keywords in here. Then I want my keywords in here. Then I want my name, address, phone number, website link in here, and see our previous post. And this hyperlinks back to this post, right? That is called a GMB stack. Then I have a learn more button that links to this actual service on this actual page, right? And that's how I will do my 
post and you can see getting 13 views 12 views 11 views I do these five days a week for every single one of my clients all right now if we were to look back at your posts here and let's say let's take the you know the actual listing and go to Google okay <clears throat> let's look at some more things you don't have any question and answers you can do this in the back end of local Viking or you could put a question in here via a one specific Gmail account and then go in in the back end and answer them as far as your description it's great you have your keywords in here you have the area which is Dublin um, you are posting but you're not posting enough and you're not stacking your posts the way I personally would and I would definitely suggest you to do that um, if you have any other questions and need any help just let me know I'm here to help and I gladly help you um, take care of these um, audit issues on your Google my business listing as well as your website overall your websites good but I mean we're going to do one last thing for you so we'll look at a couple of things we're going to look at your page speed or what we call your core vitals according to Google search console and um, Google to see if it's going to pass your core vitals test core vitals test is what this last if you will um, algorithm update was concerning and if you pass it great if you don't it will hurt your rankings some people care some people don't care um, but we want to make sure you're passing your core vitals test if you're not I would suggest you get your website rebuilt in Gutenberg and get your core vitals passing your SEO up it goes over performance best practices SEO and specifically we want to pass on mobile desktop is very easy to pass on but mobile is the one that's a real bitch to get past so we want to make sure we can do that and we're going to go through this and see if we can do this or not so we'll wait for it to give us the results and once it gives us the results then we'll go from there and we'll look at your rankings too I also have a ranking report so um, you're not passing you're passing accessibility which is good uh, but you're not passing page speeds performance you're not passing on best practices and you're up you're almost passing on SEO so we need to get these all in green 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 okay I mean it tells you your speed index is an issue your time to interactive is an issue all these different issues in here and we definitely want to get these taken care of okay now if we go over to your actual ranking reports let's take a look at that so on your and we didn't run a full one but this is just hey this is what we found you know you only have eight percent visibility in Google which is terrible I mean you're not ranking at all the only thing you're really ranking for is your actual domain name you're not ranking for house painters in Dublin you're not ranking for painter you're not ranking for painters and decoration you're not ranking for painting service painters any of that so